So I heard you on a backpack tour. Starting with the bag itself, I have a barley bag. It's pretty cool. Um, I really liked, I kind of went through a couple of backpacks to see which ones I liked. I really liked this adjustable strap and it's really thick and nice and it's not just going to like rub against you all the time. Um, I have a little hand sanitizer thing, obviously I work in healthcare, so have that. I really liked these little, you can kind of see that these are kind of a leather, they may actually be leather um, material. It's pretty sturdy. I really like that about it. It has that same kind of leather material here. Well, that's up. So I really kind of liked, I liked the look of it, but I also liked how kind of hefty it is. Obviously there's a bunch of stuff in here. Um, there are two pockets on the outside, on the side, which obviously has my water bottle and then some other stuff in here. And the front pocket is kind of typical front pocket stuff, but we'll go over that. So starting on the outside, I have the thing I take to work every day. And yes, it's a Stanley. I'm so sorry. Um, I've had it for quite a while. <laughs> um, it's the Rose Quartz um, 30 ounce, I think. And I like, you can kind of see the staining on it. I like these little self closures. I do have, <laughs> which I've had these for a long time, but I do have a Stanley cup that has the straw in it. I don't like that. Um, I prefer to have these when I go to work because it's just a little easier, it's a little safer to have your um, spout kind of moving around like that. So you can actually kind of keep it safe and keep it protected instead of just having a straw. Also, spill proof, and I am a spiller. We'll get to that in a second. This part out here is just some daily grooming stuff and my AirPods. So I do have the AirPod third gen, um, they're pretty cool. I use them a lot more at home um, than I do at work because at work it's a little bit busy so I like to have the noise canceling. But I really like these a lot. Um, I do have a little hair clip. A lot of this stuff is kind of grooming things. I have a little hair clip to keep my hair out of my face. And then a lot of this other stuff is just grooming. Um, I keep, I do keep tooth, I keep floss, hello, no it'll focus. I do keep floss in there. Um, I have a Lana Lips as well as a Glossier co uh, CoconutBalm.com. This one I'm very sad about because Glossier actually changed the, um, the recipe for these. So I've switched to Lana Lips just to try to see it, see if I like it or not. Um, that's kind of where that is. And then obviously I have nails, so I do keep a nail trimmer in my bag, just in case. So for this front pocket, I have a little iffy guy. Let's see if I can grab my bag up. So I have a little Miffy, which I really like. It's very soft. It's mostly there for decoration, but it's also kind of just there for me to play with. Um, Inside of Miffy's pocket is the normal kind of front pocket things. I do have my Ray-Bans in here. I wear very dark sunglasses. We've talked about this before um, because I have a corneal abrasion and those are very hard to heal. And I have very light colored eyes. So I have some difficulty seeing in bright sunlight. Um, I do have my hand cream in here. I usually keep this around, obviously, again, work in healthcare, so <laughs> it's really useful to have a hand cream around that um, really takes care of dry skin. Um, and this is one of my favorites, absolutely my favorite. And I've got my wallet in here. This was a gift for graduating, getting my graduate degree as a present. It's a really pretty Dior wallet. Um, it's got two card pockets here, a card pocket here, and then like a cash pocket in there. It's really cool. Obviously it has a little has a little hidden pocket in there, but I don't carry a lot because I mostly use my phone. My car key's in there, obviously. Um, it 
does have, this is one of my favorite. I don't have a keychain because you see I have a fob, so my car is push start. So I keep a, <laughs> I want to go with a puppy. It might not focus. Of course it won't. But it's a little, it's a little name tag with Brago's name on it. He's listening to me right now. I surrender. There's a pile of stuff over here in frame. <laughs> and then I also have this little guy, which was a gift from a family member a while back. It's a little pouch that has, um, it has my, an extra memory card for vlogging and then my extra batteries just in case. So on the inside, it's closed by this little drawstring. Not usually a big fan of drawstrings, but I do like it in this case. Um, the first thing that's inside is <laughs> my phone. Um, I do have the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Um, I've had it for quite a while now and I really like it. It's pretty good. You see a lot of my vlog footage is from here, so it's excellent. Um, I have a little, this is just from Amazon, I have a little grocery pouch because oftentimes after work I will go to the grocery store and pick up some groceries. And here in Colorado, we've actually gotten rid of plastic bags and you have to pay 10 cents for the paper bags. So inside I also have my AirPods Pro, or my AirPods Max. Um, I do really like these. They're very nice. Um, obviously, they're just like the, all the others that you've ever seen. They're pretty cool. Um, I don't use them. I use them to edit a lot, and I use them to work out, and when I'm at work for the noise canceling. It's pretty, it's pretty efficient at that. I also have a notebook, which this is brand new since I just started this job. Um, this is a brand new notebook. I usually keep a moleskin around with notes and thoughts and I have one that I keep for my MCAT studying so that I know what areas I'm weak in. Um, but this is a brand new one that I haven't used yet so maybe later we can do a tour of them. Inside I also have my iPad. It's the 2021 12.9 inch. Um, it's been good to me so far. Um, I just have the kind of standard Apple case on it just to keep it safe. I also have inside, so inside of here, there are quite a few pockets. We have the kind of the pocket the iPad came from and a zipper pocket. Inside the zipper pocket is a wide collection of things. And first, I have my Apple Pencil, which obviously I use with my iPad. Everybody kind of knows what those look like. I have a bunch of pens because my pens always get stolen and I have a an assortment of pens that I like. Um, my first favorite will almost always be the Zebra Sarasa. If you're a pen fanatic, these are, these are definitely my favorite. I've got two of them in here. And then I also have a Muji pen, which I keep around kind of as a backup, which is really nice. And then I have a Pilot G2, which is kind of every study person's favorite pen. <laughs> um, and then I also keep around, just for that moleskin that I talk about, I also keep around some of the Zebra Mild Liners, and everyone's always obsessed with these. Um, I think they're excellent. A friend of mine sent me some of these, so I have used them ever since because they are pretty incredible. And then, I think last but not least, inside of the backpack is yet another bag. And we will explore that now. So, inside of here, I call this my emergency bag. It has all kinds of stuff in here. Um, I do have some Altoids, just in case. You know, maybe you have some coffee or you have a snack or something. Um, on that brain, I do keep a protein bar in there. Um, because I do take ADHD meds, sometimes I forget to eat and having a protein bar around is a really good thing. I have an extra lightning cable, which eventually will be obsolete. I do keep some masks in here. These are KN95s. Um, 
they're just all around good in case I don't have one in my purse or in my bag or if we need them at work and I just don't happen to have one, which we usually do. Also keep an extra hand sanitizer in here. This is, of course, Bath and Body Works. And let's see, I usually keep in some of these little pouches I keep, um, I have a charging brick for my phone. So this actually just, um, this is really cool. It's actually just a MagSafe charging pack and it just attaches to the back of your phone and it'll charge your phone up pretty well. I've never had any issues. I tend to charge up if I'm under 40%, so I really like this guy, he's pretty cool. And I keep the cable to charge him up in there just so I never am out of a cable. I do have a hair tie because hair tie. And I also keep in here a little box. I'm not gonna open it, but I do keep some extra of um, each of my medications. I keep two days worth of doses just because, again, I have ADHD, so sometimes I forget, and that's just, <laughs> that's just the way of life. So sometimes I forget to take my medicine and I need this little guy to help me out. And then the only other thing that's in here are a bunch of bandages. So that is the entirety of my bag tour, and I really like it. So far it's been a pretty nice backpack. Maybe do a one year review of it. It's been pretty pretty nice so far. There are water bottle pockets inside of here, but I just carry mine outside, um, outside the bag. So it's really nice. I like it so far. Thanks for watching.